amazing. Look who made a return. <laughs> Hello! So Leah is gonna be living with me for a little bit again, and tonight we're gonna make some Oreo cheesecake. No bake Oreo cheesecake. Uh, I'm gonna make a new little like segment here and there. Uh, so just like a new series, I guess, here and there, um, injected into my normal videos. We're just gonna do some bus bakes, some bus, nah, bus eats. It's not gonna be all baking. I'm not very good at baking, but I like cooking. So we're gonna make some cool recipes for you guys that are easy to make on the road. That's why we're doing a no-bake Oreo cheesecake. Let's get right into it. This cheesecake came in around probably $15 or so. Apparently the recipe says it only takes about 25 minutes to make. I don't believe that. We're gonna see how quick we can do it. And then you also have to put it in the fridge for four hours. First up, we have cream cheese. Sugar and then a little bit of vanilla. Now that's the money shot right there. It smelled really good at first when I first started mixing the, these other ingredients in, but now it just is like kind of eh, like straight cream cheese. I'm sure it's gonna taste really good, especially with the Oreos mixed into it. So that's actually the next step. Okay, I was wrong. The next step is some heavy cream, some whipping cream. Whip it in a bowl. Hey Siri, how many cups are in a pint? One pint is two cups. Two cups, perfect. The whole thing, all of it. That's a lot of heavy cream. Ah, uh, I'm getting close. I am going off of my diet that I have to be on for uh, my stomach tomorrow so I can have this cheesecake tonight. Matthew currently is trying to whip this heavy whipping cream. It's not getting thicker. Oh, can you make the speed faster? That's the key. Ladies and gents, he has figured it out. It says stiff peaks. All right, next step, we're folding it in. That is cheesecake for sure. That's cheesecake filling. We have the Oreos, the good part, finally. Crushed up Oreos go in and crushed up Oreos go on top. So I'm just gonna kinda mash them with my hands. Yeah, man. There we have it. So we have like enough for a second one, so... Are we gonna make a second one? Heck yeah, we are. We're not making a second one, at least right now. Oh, well then we're gonna eat the rest of that film. We're gonna put Oreos on top and then we have to wrap it up and throw it into the fridge for at least four hours until it hardens up. It's Leah's turn. She's gonna do the topping for us. She's gonna make it nice and pretty. <laughs> this is art, she says. A plus for art class. Again. Thank you. The art of baking, huh? <laughs> now there it is. Leah made it look all pretty for us. The final step for right now is gonna be wrap it up, put it in the fridge, and then we get to taste it. This is super easy, yeah. Yeah, yeah. couldn't have taken us more than like half an hour. For ease of, of creation, I definitely recommend. And we're back, it's the next day. We didn't get our cheesecake last night. No. Uh, <laughs> we probably were up late enough, we're to up be late honest. Enough, yeah, by the time we did go to bed. I'm gonna try the cheesecake now. I did, however, Leah doesn't even know, because Leah was gone all day uh, subbing. So, I, she doesn't even know, but I had a little bit of the filling on my uh, oh sticky my bun this God. morning. The leftover filling. <laughs> now I'm mad. <laughs> That looks like a real cheesecake. Like, yeah, it does. Not even no bake. It, yeah, it doesn't. Looks pretty good. Yeah. That's really good. I don't think I'm ever gonna make a, like a baked cheesecake. I would like to make a baked one at some point. Bro, why not this tastes great. <laughs> this is amazing. This is a great dessert for traveling because it's so easy. Like literally so easy. The only thing is if you have a beater, you'd have to have mm -hmm. like a beater. So I guess that's a big win in Leah's book. If you guys didn't know, Leah is the queen of sweets. She'll eat anything sweet. Except for that orange thing. Leah doesn't like it. Nice work, Leah. Nice work. Nice work, Matthew. 
I'm gonna leave the recipe in the description for you guys to check out and make yourselves. Like I said, super, super, super easy. It literally took what, like 30 minutes maybe last night? Yeah, the, the most of it was just the cooling time. How many buses out of 10? What's the scale? On a dessert scale, it's like a 8-3. Eight, four. I do want to start posting more as we start traveling more in the coming months. We'll be putting out more of these bus eats videos for sure. Leah likes baking, she likes sweet things, and I like cooking and savory things. So you're gonna get hit with all of it. It's pretty much gonna wrap up the video for the week and uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Peace. <laughs>